Do you do you know if you're gonna live past this year? Don't know. Don't know. You don't know if you're gonna die tomorrow. You don't know if you're gonna die tomorrow. None of you know. So I'm gonna tell you again. Please repent of your sins. There are young men dying in their sleep every day. Twenty-three year old young men dying in their sleep every day. Please repent of your sin. I don't know how old you are. But you, you, you look young, same way. So, repent of your sin, man, before you die. Because you just went and refilled your cup after you drank. I don't even know how many batches you've had just now. Getting drunk is wrong. And every day you have the cup in one hand and the weed in the other hand. Just sucking on one and swallowing the other. Sucking on one and swallowing the other. So, 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 so one and then two. Two and then three. One and two. This is you. This is you. Every day you do this. Every day. Smoking and drinking. It is wrong. Stop doing it. And I'm not going to stop telling you the same thing. Because what I'm telling you is repentance. What I'm saying. God bless you, man. God bless you. What I'm saying is repentance. This is all repentance. Turn from your sin. Stop living in sin. Because if you don't stop, you are going to face God in judgment. The Bible says in Romans chapter 2 verse 5, But because of your stubbornness and unrepentant heart, you are storing up wrath for yourself in the day of wrath and revelation of the righteous judgment of God. Verse 6 says, God will render to each person according to his deeds. Every single one of us are going to be judged when we die. Are you right with God? Oh, certainly you don't look like you're right with God at all. You don't look like you're right with God at all. And the Bible says you will know them by their fruits. I can look at your life and I can know if you're right with God or not. And you don't look like you're right with God. You're cursing Pete. You're cursing me out. You're telling me bad things about myself. You're insulting me. All of these wicked things are coming from your heart. The Bible says, from the heart, the mouth speaks. The mouth speaks from what fills the heart. Shall go ahead so you should repent. She go healthy, she don't repent. Tell them all the time, brother. Tell them all the time. But tell them all the time, brother. I tell everybody to repent. You think I'm only telling you? I tell my brothers to repent. I tell my sister to repent. I tell my father to repent. Everybody who knows me, ask them. Everybody who knows me. That's why nobody wants to come around me. Because I always tell them to repent of their sin. And it makes them uncomfortable. You don't want people around you to tell you you're wrong. That's why you dwell around weed smokers and scammers and drinkers. Because you all do the same thing. So you love each other. You love each other. You don't want people to come around you and tell you to repent of your sin. You don't want people to come around you and tell you to turn from your sin. Because you love your sins. You love them so much. And you think God loves you. You think God loves you. I'll, I'll, I'll be gone soon. I have 10 more minutes. God bless you, man. God bless you. God bless you. If you are stealing, repent, because if you don't stop, you're going to hell. If you're stealing, stop. If you're stealing, you are a thief, and you must stop doing it. Oh, thief. Let me say it now, if you're a top scam, you're a thief. Top thief. And he's burning, actually, he's burning, he's burning.
Ibonia man, Ibonia good. Me glad say Ibonia na say go think about you na go your bed tonight. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna think about this tonight. That's what I want. You're gonna think about this tonight, man. That's what I want. I want you to think about this because every single one of you, everybody who has sex out of marriage, all of you who steal money. Oh, you can't fit much. Because they're not tell us to repent, man. Because they're not tell us to repent. The pastor, they're not tell us to repent. That's why. Everybody who has sex out of marriage, everybody who has sex before they get married, if you do not repent, you are going to die and go to hell. Anybody. Nobody is exempt. The Bible says that all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. I hope you repent, sir. You walking away. I hope you repent. God not hear your prayer. If you are living us in God not hearing your prayer. I'm preaching down there tomorrow. God bless you with long life and prosperity. God bless you, man. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you, man. God bless you. God bless you. If you're a scammer, you're a thief, man. You're a thief. Repent. You're born as a thief. What a name you give yourself, brother. No, man. That wicked. You're born as a thief. You go go ahead as a thief then. You're gonna go to hell if you don't repent. If you don't repent, you're gonna go to hell, man. You are stuck with me every Thursday for two hours. Every Thursday for two hours, you're stuck with me. You're going to hear the gospel every Thursday. I'm going to just hope and pray that the gospel message gets to your heart and you repent. That's all I can do. You know? After I preach, just pray. That's all I can do. Because the Bible said, the Bible said, because I can expect this. I expected this to happen. The Bible says, you can look this up for yourself. 1 Corinthians chapter 1 verse 18. The message of the cross is foolishness to those who are perishing. Chapter 2, verse 14, the Bible says, The natural man does not accept the things of the Spirit. John chapter 7, verse 7, the Bible says, The world will hate you because you confess that their deeds are evil. That's what that verse teaches, rather. John chapter 7, verse 7, the Bible teaches that the world will hate you because you testify that their deeds are evil. When someone tells you that your deeds are evil, you hate them. You don't like them. You insult them. But no one can stop me from saying it again. You are a thief if you don't stop stealing money from people overseas. Thief. And unless you repent, you will go to hell. But I'll say the gospel again because I have, I, have, I have five minutes left before I have to go. Five minutes. I have five minutes left, everyone. That's good news for a lot of you. Five minutes. I'll leave when I'm ready. I'll leave when I'm ready. I hope you repent of your sins, sir. God no likes scammer. 
God no like scammer. So kill God. All of you who are scammers, you are thieves. And you are going to hell if you don't repent. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Every insult you give me, I give you a blessing. God bless you with long life and prosperity. If you are living in sin, you are going to hell, sir. You and I, white shirt. If you are living in sin, you are going to hell. You are going to hell. And make no mistake if you think that I'm afraid of you. Make no mistake about it. I'm not afraid of anybody up here. Repent of your sin, all you scammers, all you thieves, and all you fornicators, all of you who have sex out of marriage. Repent of your sins. Repent of your sins. Here, you may I talk to that white shirt. You. You in the white shirt. You're, I'm talking to you. Repent of your sins. If you are a scammer, repent. I don't know if you're a scammer. I don't know. So I'm not going to make any assumptions. If you are a scammer, you in the white shirt, stop it. It is wrong. It is stealing. And you will go to hell if you don't stop. I got three minutes left before I have to go. Three minutes. Because I told you I'm going to preach for two hours. God bless you, man. God bless you. I'm coming here every Thursday. Every Thursday. Every Thursday. Because you in our white shirt. Me no afraid of you, brother. Me no afraid of you. If you think me afraid of you, I make a mistake. I'm not afraid of nobody up here. I'm not afraid of any of you. If you feel like someone can intimidate me, don't intimidate me on top. I don't stay bad because I'm not afraid of now. Throw the stone. Fling it. Fling the stone. Go ahead. Because I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid of now. I'm going to tell you again. Repent on your sin because of your teeth. If you don't repent on your dead, you'll go to hell. I say it again and again and again. Make it burn on Because I'm not afraid of no. None of them are not afraid of. And all of you who have sex out of marriage, you're going to hell as well. Repent of your sin. All the weed smoke of them as well. Repent of your sin or you're going to go to hell. Every single one of you. Every single one of you. You think you can intimidate me. I'm not afraid of any of you. None of them are not afraid of. I know I'm going to come up here and I'm going to go along, so I'm afraid. Yeah, all of us sin. But there's only one way to be saved, all of us, and that's what I've been preaching up here. The only way you can be saved is by turning to Christ, trust in Christ, believe in Christ, and you will be forgiven. And I'll preach this every Thursday, every single Thursday for two hours. I have to bear it for two hours. And I have two minutes left before my time is up. Two minutes. Come here and I, and I threaten me. It thinks I'm afraid of you. I'm afraid of you. I'm afraid of you. If we had to the street light tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Repent of your sin, man. But then keep on threatening because. Oh, no. you, you keep on threatening me. I go to Negril, Montego Bay, Sandy Bay, Montpelier, everywhere. And I get threats all the time. I'm not afraid of you. None of you, I'm afraid of none of you. Yeah, me. Me, lo me love one or two. Me love one or two. But guess what? God don't like scammer. God don't like thief. So. So I have, I have one minute left. I'll say this one last time. 
for those who can hear me and for those who will listen. God sent his son into the world to die for sinners. The Bible says that all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. Everybody here has sinned. I've sinned. You've sinned. We're all sinners. But the way that we can be saved is by trusting in Christ and repenting of our sin. Have to turn from our sin. Have to turn from your sin. And you will be forgiven. Alright, we finished now. I'm done now. This is it for the day, everyone. God bless you. God bless you. Peace.